here we are. Hi oh, wait. guys. I have to get taller. <laughs> <laughs> okay, if I fall over, just catch me. <laughs> we were just talking about how she needs a pair of heels when I she do. stands here. I do. I really do. <laughs> well, welcome guys. Welcome to the end of season one. This is we're episode not... eight, but it's not over. Yeah, we're not done completely. This is just the end of season one. So we're going to take a little break. Um, from the assembled challenge. Now yes. that does not mean that we're taking a break from providing you with no. content. We will, we will still see you here. next week yeah. and the following week At before we start again. So, mm -hmm. so there will still be stuff coming up with that. However, the change of the season does mean a little fun change as well. And she comes over and she springs this on me. I have an announcement <laughs> I'm going to make for everyone today. <laughs> So, here's the thing. She has no idea what the twist is that we're going to add to season two. But you guys have a part in this too. So you guys are going to get to decide what the difficulty level of this twist is going to be. So you're going to vote and you're going to pick a number between one, which is going to be the easiest, and five, which is going to be the most difficult. Remember that the more difficult it is, the funnier it's going to get. <laughs> so. Pick a number between one and five, you and I want you... You encourage them to do the highest number. <laughs> leave your number, like go to the comments right now and leave us a number. And I will check over the next week on my channel, on Becky's yeah, channel. Yeah, don't bother leaving any on mine. On our YouTubes, everything. Everywhere that this video gets posted, I'm going to check to get your votes so on how difficult gonna, this is going to be. What are you going to add in? What's going to make it harder? I'm not telling you yet. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm just finally, finally have come to terms with, I can do this. I can do this. And now you're changing it. Yeah, because we're not going to go into coast here. We're going to actually just keep increasing it every season. Okay. Make it a little different. Pretty soon we'll be stamping the outside of the house. <laughs> we could probably it, do that, no, actually. No, no. Just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> All right, guys. Today we're at my house and we are going to use the Picture Perfect stamp set. I believe this one also is an option in your starter kit. Okay. So we are going to go ahead and pick our product. You pick this time. No splashes, no splashes, no splashes. No splashes. <laughs> Somebody sent me a message last week and said, you really need to get used to that gel press. I'm like, no, I don't. Gel press? <laughs> what does it say? Stencils. Oh, stencils. We, we have not had this that. one yet. Stencils. Now i got to figure out if I have any. Oh, I have one, two. I have a couple because <laughs> I did two. <laughs> I'm like, hmm. hmm. Stamps. Well, stamps, an extra set of stamps. Whoop, whoop. Stamps is always good. Stencils and stamps. Pearls, sequins, or drops. I love that. One more. One more. Come on, embossing paste. Oh, God, no. No. Ribbon. Ribbon. <laughs> Woo! This will be my week. <laughs> All right. Okay. You ready? Okay. I think. <laughs> Any other announcements? Make sure you share this video. Like, comment. Um, let your friends know. What else? Yeah. Okay. Get them in to vote so that you get the number that you want to come up. So. No voting. And remember, number one. <laughs> <laughs> I can still make number one pretty difficult. <laughs> she will make it the hardest no matter what you guys vote. So, just, yeah. No. Right? I actually have, like, numbers in place. So, if, if three gets the best number, then there's an actual, like. You and your systems. I have systems. So. All right, guys, we're going to turn you around. We're going to go choose some uh, products Stuff. to use, <laughs> and then we'll get started. All right, you are going to see a little bit of my camera stand in the way, but that's okay. Okay, so I have to look at our stuff again because I don't Another even know. set of stamps. Sarah, are you going to choose Flannel Life? I am going to use this for my stencil. I have my own flannel life with me. Okay. Oh, wait, I have to use a stencil. I'm going to use this stamp. See, I can pull from my own stuff for some of this. You brought all your own stuff? I brought some stamps and I brought some stencils because... Well, I... Um... Wow. This just shouldn't be that hard. It's... Can we just stamp up the donuts? <laughs> I like donuts. 
nuts. <laughs> okay, I guess um, I'll just use this one. And what stencils do I have? We have such a wide variety. This will be fun. We have bubbles and we have a bloom wall. I have the vintage screen too. Okay. Vintage screen, what does that look like? It's the hexagon one. Oh. I can show you. No, it's all good. I don't okay. want that one because um, I'd have to figure out even more what to do with it. What color do we want our camera theme to be? Oh, Sarah's going gray. What color goes with this? Oh my gosh. I have no idea. I have no idea. Okay, so. I might be changing something though. Pearls and drops and rhinestones and stuff. I'm changing my background stamp. Can't go wrong with this and because I saw this. I don't know what. And that is gonna help. That's what I was gonna use. That's what I had in my hand, and then I, I thought, well, where am I gonna add in a, a stencil on top of that? So that didn't work out so well. My brain shut down. <laughs> okay, let's uh, figure out what we're gonna do here, guys. I am going to turn this camera around. I am taking forever trying to figure out what I want to do. Well, join the club. Oops. Okay, and I'm going to get you turned around here. Okay guys, so last time we were here at Becky's, I had kind of a wobbly camera and I don't know why, so we're gonna hope that's not the case today. Yeah, I hope it's wobbly again. They won't be able to see what you're doing. You just need to... Be nice, I know. Calm yourself. Oh, calm myself. <laughs> I'm just pulling up my chat here real, real quick guys, so I can actually see what you're saying. See if you've been putting a whole bunch of votes in there for the... Ooh, I got a number four. You do not have time to be looking at that right now. <laughs> okay. Paint the house with splashes, Shelly. That's funny. That's really funny. Okay, I think that... Well, you know, Becky's just... been redecorating. We could actually, like, make her some throw pillow covers with it. That's right. I have. And I'm getting all new carpet. I can't wait. That's what happens when all your kids leave and go to school. You can, you know, do all of those things. So Becky has the big block, so I'm just going to set this down straight I like will that. I done in one second. You're there. fine. Because this comes on that okay, acetate, so I can actually linen. just leave it where it is. I'm going to start with this. Babe, I am done with this. Do you need it? Nope. Oh, she's so clever. All right. And then We're inking this in pool play. The bubble Ink. bubble stencil. Oh, look how many times I've used it. And we're going what? to. How many of you just buy things so that you have them? Go ahead. You don't necessarily use them, right? You just buy them. 
that's what we do. We use this one and this one. Oops. And okay, I think I got everywhere pressurized. Let's see, it's okay. very light. I like that though. That looks really cool. My uh, thing of majiggity is on uh, crooked. So, all right. So I'm gonna try now some what I'm going to do and see how it works. I actually. I am going to put no um, a strip up here I that I want that. to I have try these new things in front of you. Be, yeah, and I'm going to cut this down just a little bit. So let me go get this cut down. I can stamp. I just don't play with a lot of things. You know how you always have your favorites, and that's what you stick to, right? Okay, here we go. Oh, that's going to look cool. Okay, so I cut this down to just two inches. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and take that pool so play again. Over this. And I'm going to start inking on the edge here. Ooh, cool. And what we're going to do okay, we'll just is keep get on going. kind of a gradient going. And keep reloading. Oh, I probably should have done this in an ombre kind of look. That would have been cool. But hey, we're doing good. We have it on the paper, right? She's here. I think I made them all darker. Well, look at that. So are you guys signed up for Inking Idaho on the road? I have been seeing coming up in my okay. like on this day yeah. stuff in Facebook coming up where yeah, I actually I presented at on the road on Inking box. Idaho on the road last year. Okay. And it's been kind of so fun to see now, some of those pictures pop up again and just remind me of the fun that we've had in the previous years. Do with this? But we've got that stamp it in black. coming up here in April. And I believe there's still some tickets left for Inking Idaho on the Road, yeah, right? There's, there there's are a few left. Yep. So if you guys wanted to come join us, it's t like a whole day, a whole Saturday, and then you can also come on Friday night and yeah. come stamp with us and just have so fun. Friday night, we're talking about Inky Idaho on the road. So Friday night is just a short three-hour stamping session. We call it kind of a warm-up to Saturday. Saturday is like a marathon. And there's displays and presentations and all sorts of fun stuff that goes along with it. So if you guys are looking for a road trip, you want to come play with us, this would be the time to do it. It's going to be so fun. All right, we're gonna cut one of these out. And I have done some pretty, pretty things for previous years for display and things like that. So there's okay. there's always so much to look at. I mean, there's so many talented paper crafters out there and Becky seems to find them all and bring them all to this event. How do you like that? I think that looks really freaking cool. Let me see it. Uh-uh. On. It's the end of season one. Can I just get a little preview of what you're doing? No, because then you'll copy it. I can't. I'm a little too late. I'm already knee deep Fine. into some. Take a look. Oh, that's ugly. <laughs> What'd you do that for? You're you're okay. full of it too. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right, I'm gonna try to cut okay. this out on one of the circles. So let's get some adhesive. Wait a minute, is was that on here? What did you have on that background? You're kind of doing the same colors as me. Oh, well, this will be fun. You guys are going to be judging something pretty similar, except for you know that they never ever turn out that way. They really don't. You know, you know what? I had actually picked out this ribbon, and I don't like it now because now that I've got this going on. I originally was kind of thinking I was going to do a monochrome okay, look, but now so I'm changing now, it. Now I think we'll just take some Let me go get these. some different ribbons. Oh, it looks like an eyeball. And we're just going to pop that up. And we should have drawn glitter. Okay, so we need some of these little foam squares. So we'll see which direction this goes on first. Okay, so now we have a little bit of dimension to our camera. Oh, I think this okay. might be a little bit on now, the wide side the for ribbon, what I'm doing, guys. but what I am going to. Are we going uh, to do no, I don't like ribbon. that. Um, ribbon, ribbon. Where are you going to put this? What if we put a ribbon down here? No? 
let's see. Oh goodness, this is, um, I can't think. I don't like cards that way. And this I might be like too dark. No, I kind of like it. Okay, do not, don't forget to smile. Um, so if I can find okay, my shears. I guess let's just cut a little piece here. Be right back. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some adhesive and just put it right on the edges here. And then that way I can just attach my ribbon and fold it right over where I want it to be and it'll okay. stay put. Oh, I cut it and then I throw it on the floor. What about if we... Good thing Daphne didn't get up. Do this, I know. Oh, she, she stole a baby wipe out of the garbage can today and she shredded it all over the stairway. That's just fun. <laughs> I think that's what she was grabbing right before we started. Oh, she's such a brat. <laughs> Whoever thought getting a puppy was a good idea. Should okay, so now we have to add our stamps. So we're going to grab okay. one. I goodness sakes, what am I gonna do with this thing? I think we need a piece of black. <laughs> Are you done with your stamps? Um, well, yeah, you can have them until I'm ready. Until you're ready? And then I'll just take them from you. <sighs> Dropping your... I'm trying to decide which camera I actually want. The one I used is right there on my yeah. thing. Okay. I actually think I'm going to switch to this I one. I have to just mount this so I can see. Because this see one's going to be easier to fussy cut. Like because this <laughs> is just hard to work on when you don't have any um, color behind you. So do we want it right here? Okay. So we got that inked in up. Somewhere. I'm just gonna. Oh my gosh. Put this on here. What do you do when you have a sentiment the same size as that? Maybe I will. So now we're gonna just loop this and cut oh. this down. We could make a camera strap. Oops, I said that out loud. Now she's probably going to copy me. Okay, so we could do... So if you ever get bored, go over to muchlovesarah.com and in the search bar on the... I believe it's on the left-hand side of the blog. Look up camera. Let's see. I yeah. made some really gorgeous 3D box cameras. So now we have that are on my blog. Strap. Do we want just a single so strap that. or do we want you like know what? I'm going to stamp this again because mm. I want to get that lens fussy cut. Okay, so what if we do it all the way across like this? So I'm just going to cut out this circle right here. I don't know, man. Does that look better or do we just want it off to the side? We're spending all of this time on a stupid thing that we don't even. No. Um, how big is this? I want to put this in here. I get to smile. I put that up a little bit. And I just have to give mad props to the puppy that's down here that's actually being really quiet today and good. I probably just cursed us, but. <laughs> I think we're going to go with this. I don't even know. You know what? It's been so long since I've had an actual camera. I honestly couldn't even tell you what the strap looked like on camera. But I think you used to sling it over your neck, right? Right. I just answered that. And okay, this, so just I'm put that just don't know right there where to put that. So uh, let's. See and then I'm going to put some foam squares on the back side of that. Sort of gathering. Oh gosh. Okay, I'm gonna actually leave those backing on that until I get okay. figured out what I'm doing with my sentiment. <clears throat> and I what I'm sentiments are even right in there. there? And then So there's only two sentiments in there. I'm Let's put do some adhesive on this. That'll fit. 
and I'm gonna put it straight. Let's ink that up. I'm gonna put this on it. Yeah. And go ahead and Let's stamp do that. that down. Let's do that. Yay! Okay. <clears throat> And before I go ahead and adhere put that down. my camera down, I am going to take a little bit of this black licorice twine. I think I want to. Out. What are you guys doing today? Anybody do a little pinch today? on Anybody here. Doing anything fun? Did you have a good weekend. We finally have some sunshine. We're so happy here. It's still chilly. It was only like I think it was like maybe. 60 something when I was out, but oh gosh, it was just nice. No, not no, it wasn't. It was like 52. Just kidding. It was really nice this weekend, though. I actually went out and sat in my backyard with my back door wide open and let my cats come outside and play, and sat out there with my laptop getting some work done. It's always a good thing. Okay. This side. Can't wait for it to actually get to a point that when I wake up, it's nice and warm and I can take my coffee out on the patio in the morning. Oh, come on. You take your coffee out on the patio in the morning, you have an instant hot flash when it's hot. <laughs> I can't do that. <laughs> Not if you get up early enough. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I guess that's the key, right? So get up early enough. I'm putting some extra foam dots here because this ribbon is right there and I want to make sure that this actually adheres down really well. So I'm just going to take the backing off of this. And then you guys leave, let me know in the comments, what do you think? Should I put this on a pool play mat? Should I put it on a oatmeal cookie? So should it be like craft color? Should it be the blue that I'm using? Okay, and we glued it down. So we need to have some pearls or rhinestones or something. I like rhinestones today. Mm. I use pearls all the time. Okay, so now we have some interest to go in on our sentiment. Yay. Now what? The heck Let's we gonna do, with do the rest of it? a rhinestone here. Okay, so we'll just put this rhinestone up here. Why don't you sit down? Here. Boy, that's uh, might be kind of dumb. Down here. Down here. Let's see if we have some. I think that that's works that's really well. Really big. I'm thinking. Want one of these? Gosh, I think it needs a pool play mat. I'm gonna grab that. Ah, nothing like knowing exactly what you're doing. All right, so do we put the rhinestone right there? Oh, hey, I know. Let's just deck this thing out. Let's put the rhinestone inside of all of these. Since we have no clue what we're doing, we'll just keep on doing. He's too little. Over there. Oh, and this is so weird. This is, do I need one right there? Yes? No, let's just not. Okay, so that's the flash, right? That is the flash. So we'll put a big rhinestone right okay. here. So let's mat that. And then, then we're going to need a card base. And I'm kind of leaning towards oatmeal cookie oatmeal. for my card base. Oh, here, here's the oatmeal cookie. No, for cardstock. Oh, just kidding. Yeah, we do need one over here if that's what we're going to do. I'm going to line it up symmetrically. So we're going to go. Okay, so now we got to put one. Line that here. up. Where'd that go? So let's go get our card base. Did I not pick it up? I'll probably find that later this afternoon somewhere. Okay, so now let's just take this off for now. 
How close are you to being done, Sarah? Probably about two minutes. Two minutes? Oh my God, I have to think fast again. Okay, so we are... Two minutes? Okay. Okay. Put some foam squares on the back of this. Okay. Line this up and get this on our base. And take this off. We'll try that. But I'm okay. I'm going to leave a thingy right here. So I'm going to take my glaze here. So I'll do that. And hey, you didn't draw glaze. You can't use glaze. It's adhesive. It's not. <laughs> it is not. Okay, Sarah's cheating. Not cheating. I don't think glaze is one of the things we can draw. I guess just a given. And you've used it how many you, times on zero. cards? Full. Well, no, I had to use it on that <laughs> damn uniform. That was the ugliest you thing. You used it last oh, week, no, too. I, that's what I used it on last week. Oh, my God. That was the ugliest thing I ever did in my whole life. So all of these little pieces that are... All right. Glass. I'm just filling in with glass. Oh, there's that rhinestone. Oh, no, it isn't. He fell off of something. Okay, we'll put him back. Maybe he doesn't have any So this sticking. little applicator is just one that I have that's kind of a needle nose. It just helps okay, guys, get I, I really fine to what the heck to application. Do. That's two. We used ribbon. We used a stencil, we used an additional set of stamps, and we used rhinestones, pearls, or jewels. Okay, guys. Okay. So that is... I think we're just calling it done. The finished um, card. I Unfortunately, I can't tip it just yet until that glaze dries. But what do you think? Okay. I think All right, it's guys. a winner? We're calling it good. I like that. What do you think? So yeah. I'm going to switch no. the camera around because this is going to take me just a minute to adjust. Hang on just one moment. All right, guys. We're flipping Can you see him? Can you... <laughs> How hard do I have to go? I figure it doesn't work that way. Okay, you're just going to have to take my word for it. She's cute, she's asleep, and we're not waking her. <laughs> All of those things. Okay. okay, let me see your card. Oh my gosh, so similar. Look at that. You guys have We did use a lot of similar elements, yes. but they actually do look very different, yeah, I think. Yeah, they do. Oh, and so. you cut yours out too. All right, guys, if you're watching this live on my uh, Facebook page, you're going to need to run over to Much Love Sarah and watch Sarah on her Facebook page, and then it's up to you guys who are on Sarah's page to come over to Inking Idaho. Take a look at Becky's card and see what she did. And remember, you got to look and see what how she used the products with it. I use them see so how? well. I'm really good at this. <laughs> <laughs> She's laughing at me. And right. remember that in order to decide the difficulty for the extra twist that we're going to be adding to season two, you need to vote in the comments below. So make sure you leave us your number. Number one, number one. <laughs> five, five. Right. Number one, easy on me. Make it easy on me. <laughs> We need to get oh. you out of your rush. All right, guys. You also need to let <laughs> us know who you who made the best use of the product this week so yeah. that we can have the least crappiest card of the week trophy. I believe it went to you willingly <laughs> last week, and you deserved it. Okay, I'll give you that one. You got one. <laughs> and make sure that you come back again next Monday. We don't have an assembled episode for you. But we have but something we for around. you. We do so. indeed. All right, you guys. Um, have a great week, and we will see you soon. Bye-bye. Much love to you all.